Right, hello, week 38, Tony Slimming Vlog. Before we start, I'd just like to say thank you for all your comments, all your nice thoughts, all your inspiration, all your motivation, all your support really for the past week. Uh, much appreciated, thank you very much. This week, I didn't actually go to Slimming World. It was a bank holiday Monday. <coughs> Slimming World was on, but in all fairness, I was that busy um, with the kids and everything else. It completely slipped my mind. I'd had a drink on Monday, and I thought, you can't really go to Slimming World. A bit tipsy. Um, it was not right, so a week off um, of weigh-in. So I've stood on the scales at work just to see whereabouts I am and according to them I've maintained so fingers crossed it was a maintained week um, I'll give you a proper update next Monday um, let's see how it goes as for this week as it's been a bank holiday weekend uh, went to a friend's barbecue it was very good very good I think I only had one burger and I had some of the salad bar um, generally my eating at the moment because I'm trying to maintain. I am having some things I shouldn't have because I'm thinking I've got to stop the weight loss. I've got to, you know, put the breakers on it, if you would like. You know, which is the odd garlic, or oh, not the odd garlic pizza, the odd slice of garlic pizza, the odd breadstick, and the odd cheesy crackers, stuff that you would tend to steer away from or not have as much of is the stuff I've actually been having in small quantities to try and stop it so it seems to be working so I'm getting there I'm still doing the insanity um, back's a bit sore actually today I was meant to do it this morning um, I will be doing it tonight I don't obviously want to injure myself too much but I think I've pulled something in my back from doing what you call the C sit-ups um, which is all about form if you have good form then you shouldn't injure yourself really and you warm up warm down but we're not doing bad, you know, I'm, I'm on track for where I want to be. I've updated a picture on my Instagram today, <coughs> which shows you a picture from this morning I took. Um, so you can see my body shape changing. And it's weird actually, because I've not done a proper picture of my body for a while. Obviously I've seen it and I've, you know, the other thing's been out there, but to do a comparison when you do them side by side from my other one I think was December I think it was and then one today it's mental you know you can see I'm gonna like a y-shaped body my waist is going in um, my man boobs are disappearing uh, that's what we want that's what I want to when I started this journey you know I wanted to be trimmer I wanted to be fitter and that's where I'm getting that's where I'm going it's uh, it's all good all good. I'm going to have to shut up for a minute now because I'm sat in traffic and everyone's looking at me and thinking, why is he talking to himself oh, like saying, a dick? I've had a break for that long. Yeah, so, all good. Um, obviously, you know my problems at the moment and I've shared them quite openly. Um, my head is getting around things. But on the same token, what I don't want to do is I don't want to revert back to just going, life's won, life's a bitch. I'm going to go back to eating, drinking, being a slob. You know, I've worked so hard to get to where I am. Which, if you ever look at these vlogs, if you follow Slimming World, you'll see it's predominantly women that do it, obviously. There are a few men that do it. There's not many of us on YouTube. And I don't know why that is. I don't know if it's because it's not a man thing. You know, women love to talk. We all know that. Men are a bit more shy in letting people know what their feelings are, as in letting people know what they're doing. Because we are men. You know, we can handle it, we can take it on the chin, we get on with it, and we just plod along. But, you know, I'm doing this for all the men that don't want to do it. As in, they want to do a Slimming World, but they don't want to record what they're doing because they don't want people to see 
that they are what's the word I was gonna say emotional but it's not emotional that they're not soft if that works yeah now obviously maybe men watching this going yeah he's right yeah thanks Tony um, but it's true you know us men like our nice image of rufty tufty and nothing bothers us but shit bothers us shit bothers everyone but the way the world is you've just got to get on with it um, what can I tell you about this week that is going to change my thoughts my motivation not a lot really apart from all your support you know I was reading through some of the messages I got um, it's quite nice it is because I've always said I'm doing this vlog for me for my reference so I can see my body changing but I've met some truly inspirational and wonderful people via YouTube via Instagram Twitter it's good support system it's good motivation system although we never probably get to meet each other it feels like you've got a whole load of new friends out there which are willing you on and which are not going through what you go to a degree but you know they feel for you genuine friends genuine mates and uh, for that for doing this I that's amazing you know to get that sort of support from people you will never meet never mind you know your normal friends and family that are around you it's uh, it's quite a good feeling it gives you a nice warm feeling inside um, I'm gonna get going now um, today's Wednesday it's a late vlog my next vlog will be at Monday because big changes again this week um, personal situations so I will have the time to do my vlog on my normal day rather than making you lot wait for my nice little rambles um, so I will see you next week on Monday night um, oh yeah because I've got to tell you actually next week I am going away to Harrogate um, part of my job is I'll go and set up an exhibition so I get to go to Betty's Tea Room and I get to have a wander around Harrogate so any of my followers if you're in Harrogate um, maybe you'd like a cup of tea in Betty's Tea Room um, maybe not maybe just give me a shout out if you're in Harrogate let me know the best places to eat um, and maybe have a drink I'll speak to you next week bye